Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, Upload you guys are going to- Upload house spoken mirrors for music. Notification center, BBR. One hour ago, <laughs> notification photos. One hour ago, notification music. Three hours ago, notification, BPME. Six hours ago, notification. <laughs> Thanks, Siri. So, we are going grocery shopping and I'm going to bring you guys along to do a little grocery haul. I have no idea how much we're going to actually be able to film in the grocery store, but I will go through everything with you when we get home. I've got my little reusable bags that I use every time. These expand like insanely, fit so much goodies in it. They're from hashtag untrashy. You know it. But yeah, so we'll go in, go shopping, get all the bits and pieces I need for the next week. I know I gotta get a couple of things for mum as well. Come back home, go through everything with you guys and you guys can see the bits and pieces that I buy for a grocery haul, haul shop. shop. A grocery shop. <laughs> Let's go. Struggles of shopping. You guys don't do this, you don't have enough food. <laughs> okay, so first of all, we're gonna start just from right to left. I went to the little local fruit grocer and got all that sort of stuff. And then I went to the butcher and got my meats that I'm going to have this week. My mum cooks quite a lot as well, so she will do some other meals during this week. But for now, this is what I would use in my meals. So first of all, we've got some light jelly. I'm gonna make up some jelly, nice and easy. Some chewing gum, sugar-free. I eat that throughout the day. Milk, chocolate, honeycomb. Now this is a massive bag but I'm actually going to share it with mum and Tanya. I'm gonna just portion it out, but I absolutely love this. I actually had this in hotel quarantine, so when I saw it, I was like, I need some more. Um, we got some eggs, some free range eggs from some little local Australian farmers. You can tell, hey, like you can tell with those eggs, even the coloring of them, so good. Okay, then we got some sauces. We got a whole heap of sauces. So I got some teriyaki marinade and stir fry sauce, which I'll use Probably not this week, but later on. And then I got some tamari soy sauce, some light maple, sugar-free light maple syrup, and some barbecue sauce to make up a sort of caramelized Asian barbecue sauce for my meat. So I got those three. I've got some broccoli, which I will chuck into either a stir fry. I might even roast some of that up. I got some big ass light cheese. These are like the biggest light cheese I've ever seen in my life. Usually light cheese are like this size, but they're huge. These cost me like $16, these, but hopefully they're worth it. We'll see how that goes. And we got some avocados, nice big Hass avocados, some whole grain mustard. I actually saw this in the store section and thought I would give it a go because I ate so much mustard in the US. Um, we've got some bush honey. So this is natural Australian bush honey. It's like the natural blend. They have all different flavors, but 
I just have this one and I have it on my rice cakes with some almond butter so got rice cakes there red onion I always put in my salads I put it on my wraps I just love red onion I'm not even sure why passion fruits my favorite fruit to date passion fruit mango is just like you can't beat it got some turkey for sat not for salads some turkey for some wraps and stuff we've got dried mango spears we've got almonds tuna so these two are chunky tomato and basil so they're just flavored the stuff that i would just eat off the spot and then i've got oh i've got tuna in oil which i will use with my rice and avocado soy sauce and japanese mayonnaise in like a little bowl i get this oat chocolate milk <laughs> i freaking love this i love this chocolate milk it is so good so it's vegan obviously it's oat milk chocolate's the bomb go get it two mangoes again love mangoes love passion fruit these are like delish heaven right there just there um i got this little free range chicken and garlic risotto so it's something that you can, it's nice and easy you just heat it up they're pre-packed uh, pre in australia from woolies i actually had one probably like two weeks ago and they were really good so yeah you just put it in the pan heat it up you can put it in the microwave heat it up and eat it as is bananas in here what have we got we've got some mushrooms in here cook them up with some breakfast with some eggs and then we've got some spinach in here love my spinach nando's perinase i saw this again in the me and tanya pretty much just found the sauce <laughs> section so as you can tell mild because i am a so that and then we've got our meat and potatoes we've got the potatoes later we've got some washing liquid and I bought this smokehouse rug from the butcher. It's good for beef, chicken, and lamb. So we'll see how that one goes. Um, but yeah, so I just got a steak, some chicken breast, some bacon, and the tiniest little bit of be diced beef. I did ask, I thought I asked for 350 grams, but he sectioned out 150 grams. So I'll probably have to go back tomorrow and get some more because I want to make this sauce up with the diced beef. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. That's all I got for my ingredients. I think it came up to a total of like, without my mum's stuff and the stuff that I bought, probably like 150 bucks. But in saying that it was from local stores, it wasn't from your big branch Woolies. Um, I did get stuff from Woolies, but it was more like our snack stuff, like the rice cakes, the sauces, all of that sort of jazz. So yeah, that is it. I hope you enjoyed this little food haul of what I will be eating for this week. But I also eat out. Don't think that I just eat in all the time because I don't. I'll probably have Thai sometime this week. I'll probably have sushi sometime this week and then I'll eat this food as well. And obviously, like I said before, mum cooks quite a lot as well. So she makes a lot of, actually a lot of Italian pastas because we have a local Italian guy who does all of the fresh pasta and all of the fresh pasta sauces so we have that like once or twice a week as well sometimes we have roasts all of that sort of jazz so this is not just what i would eat in one week but it kind of is like a substitute and add-ons i eat a lot i eat a lot guys anyway hope you enjoy this video i'll see you on the next one